A pair of three lost teams square off in Spencerville. Marion Local and the hometown Bearcats resuming play after both their games got postponed last night. First half winding down, Dylan Smith trying to gain an edge and will turn everyone before netting the floater. 32-21, his squad leads. One under 10 seconds to play. Ensuing possession, Flyers with the last shot, and Tate Hess fires one up and connects, giving Marion Local a spark heading into the locker room. He'd finish with 11. Out of the break, they look to feed their sophomore big, Jack Kanapke, well in position as he banks it off the square. Game high, 14 points for him. Spencerville looking to stay ahead. Josh Henline able to find Eli Harder in the corner, and double three nails the three. This game would need overtime with the Bearcats coming out on top, 52-48. Perry is a perfect 8-0 at home. Commodores hosting Toledo Christian tonight. In transition, Ryan Yinks passes to Will Knight, and he'll lay it off glass to tie the game early on. Trailing again, Terry Riley. Nice through defenders and cashes in for two more. Then it's Brady Yinks grabbing the offensive board and goes back up with the mid-range. The senior pours in a team high 19, but his team's still down two. Now they turn to the three-point play. Aiden Simpson hands to Ryan Yinks, and the lefty finds the bottom of the net. Perry wins this one 61-51. In Finley, head coach Jim Rookie sits on the doorstep of history. One win away from setting a new school record in career wins. His Trojans hosting Elida. Opening quarter, Zori Island glides past the defense and hits the short jumper. Bulldogs go by five early on. Other end, Jake Bishop to Brock McCrancy, and he cans the tray. Then it's Max Roth getting in on the three-ball action, connecting from range. We're all tied up at 15 apiece. And now the Finley commit takes over. Roth poking the ball free, and he'll leap up to meet rim. Trojans run away 72-40. Across the interstate, Liberty Benton returns to action. Eagles have been soaring of late, 7-1 in their last eight games, taking on Ottawa Hills. They're down 10, though, in the second quarter. Joe Gherkin spots up and hits the tray to cut that deficit down. Then it's Malik Eckford driving to the basket. First attempt, no good, but persistence pays off. Team I-15 for the senior. Now it's Cameron Garlock who bounces the rock to Toby Collard, and Collard lays it in for two more. But Liberty Benton still trails by double digits. Still fighting. Garlic to Gherkin, and Gherkin weaves his way through and uses glass. Liberty Ben comes all the way back to win 59-46.